There's some strange shit going on here, Cole. gang stalking thing, I mean, it's, I was in the Walmart getting some things, and, um, because that's close to us, you know, it's, we live rurally, so you have a rural Walmart, just like in probably your town, too, and it started in, you know, there were sounds, like a couple of aisles over, this weird whistling sound that was strange, but it was just, it was starting to get, you know, my mind was starting to be attacked, you know what I mean, it was a, a straight, consistent whistle, like, they could see me through the stack of things there. I think I was in the aisle where the, I was looking for a toothpaste without fluoride. Of course, you won't find one at Walmart. They all have fluoride, right? And um, so I didn't get the toothpaste. But this whistling was going on. Then people in the aisle couldn't get out the aisle. And then they seemed to be looking at me like I didn't belong there. And, then, you know, it, it starts rolling, right? And you start hearing other sounds. And, you know, I hear bits and pieces of conversation about things that pertain to me that they couldn't possibly, you know what I mean? It's okay. So, in other words, what happened there? Now, let's, 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 let's break this down. Gang stalking 101 for, for you kids that don't know, that are trying to deal with it terrestrially, you will never, may I just say it again, I'll be the only voice in the whole world that tells you, but, you know, uh, Grandpa Zeph will tell you, look, there is no way you will ever solve it through going to meetings and having, you know, therapy and all that. Because you would be trying to, to, to heal yourself of something based on lies. Yes, they, they have objects and satellites and technology and different things they can bring to bear, and that's always changing. And then there's, you know, I had a conversation with a friend yesterday. We were talking about the interdimensional nature of this and how <clears throat> there's advanced technology as well. Every single, let me, let me get it down to the real point of it all. Every single person on Earth is a TI. Every single one. Every single soul is tracked from the cradle to the grave by advanced technology that you don't know exists. Is it, well, let, me, let me get it down to the real point of it all. Every single person on earth is a TI. Every single one. Every single soul is tracked from the cradle to the grave by advanced technology that you don't know exists. It's, it's invisible to you and me. Okay, because... Why? Because these souls are the commodity that is, you know, and also food and everything else. So, so, so we're here like cattle on a farm. Okay. The TIs are people that are very sensitive who see through to the interdimensional. They see through to the other side of this thing. They get a glimpse of what's going on. They're like the people and they live who can see without needing the glasses. So they're immediately targeted. We've got one who can see. And at that moment... They, the hive is see the glasses. So they're immediately targeted. We've got one who can see. And at that moment, they, the hive is on you. But you notice that one day they're there, one day they're not. One day it's uh, benign, one day it's a blessing, one day it's, it's back on. And it's, 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 uh, um, you know, and even sometimes the same people. They're on, they're off, they're on, they make your mind up. Well, they're not, you know, this was the subject of the last song that I was involved in with a uh, brilliant young, uh, born 19, so I thought he was younger than you, I guess he's, well, he's young, I mean, well, let's not even go in the age thing, but a brilliant guy that, you know, deals, he's really um, talked a lot about this, and, and we've been having conversations and putting our info together. And it's really helped me out because it's given me a, a glimpse into something that I have to share with you today that's very important. Don't let me leave without sharing it, okay? Don't let me stop the recording and, and sort of wig out on it or get distracted. It deals with this reality like things that you think are terrestrial, things that you think are solid, are changeable, even technology. And so as it relates to the TI, so the TIs basically are sensitive, they, they perceive what's going on. And uh, because you're sensitive, they can mess with you in your head and they play games and they do, they do this gaslighting, but they don't meet somewhere and go over a script. 
they just gather around you. They just arrive already like they've been in another dimension being scripted for it. And in fact, the people that are involved in it, that you may even know, aren't the same people that you knew before or that you'll know tomorrow. Which is the more, the really messed up thing about it. Further to that, um, I'll just give you an example. Um, you know, you people that have problems, all you call it, you, you, you people that, you don't have to call yourselves, yeah, you could be spiritual warfare people that are getting messed with. Just like um, my assistant and me, we were in, we were in, um, we had a, a kind of vacation to, to Maui, and we are in a supermarket, that I think it was a Safeway in Lahaina, and, um, you know, they, they, they started coalescing and started trying to block us, and and the, the, the person that I was with, uh, Angie, she, uh, she said, uh, do you see that? I go, yeah, it's on. <laughs> you know? and it was like, it was amazing. It was just so perfect. It was your classic, I mean, it's the kind of thing that would drive a lot of you, unfortunately, to hiding under your beds, you know, to just wanting to just, to, because it will trigger that fear thing. But we've been through this, I think, so many times. You know, and and uh, that that we we were able to hold our ground. I mean, barely because it was really nasty. And the same thing started happening at this Walmart, which hadn't happened in a long time. And I think it's because we've been talking about this subject. You know, the song that we just did, Wayward Hughes. If you want to, well, I'm going to publish what I need to. Don't let me forget this. I need to publish he, uh, uh, Gary, the 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 uh, the author of it. I guess. He sent me a breakdown of the lyrics and what they mean, and they're very specific, you know, about the situation. And um, they're very uh, kind of cryptic for the, the world. Well, the thing is, I'm reluctant be in a way because, you know, the world doesn't need to know how we... We can talk in, like, broken, you know, pigeon English almost and understand each other. You know what I mean? When we understand what we mean. Double-double. You understand what that means? Well, you know what I mean. I throw that out a lot, so you get the lexicon, and then you, you're able to kind of shorthand it, because you're smart, because you get it, because you're on top of it. You, you're not just going, what does that mean, Brother Z? You're not doing that. You're down the road. We're, we're moving down the road. You and me, we're going down the road here. It's not like we're, we're going to keep going, what does that mean? No, we got to get down. Come on, guys. Don't give me that. Look at me. I'm this instrument, a very sensitive instrument. You know what I mean? I can talk to you while you're not even listening yet in the future. That's how loose I am, you know, in this. So you got to trust that I'm going to come up with something. The Lord's going to give me something. I couldn't talk to you in the future from the past here unless I was kind of hooked up, right? On our side, in the spirit. That should be proof right there. Well, I'm not another side. They got powers like that. Yeah, okay. Okay, sure. They, they do. They've you Just sit there with your thumb up your bum. Don't do anything. Don't think. Just sit there. Let them throw rocks on you. Die on cue. Have no life at all. No contributions. <laughs> you know, because you've, you're being a good Christian... See no evil, hear no evil, and do no evil. Good Christian. See no evil, hear no evil, and do no evil. You're being a good Christian. See no evil, hear no evil, and do no evil. You're being a good Christian. See no evil, hear no evil, and do no evil.